What's up, Tesla Nation? Welcome back to another edition of T for Tesla. This is Michael. Hey, I brought you from outside into my house today, so we're going to do a little um, episode on how to use um, your battery and solar and cook, okay? Well, not really cooking, but you'll see, okay? I mean, it's kind of cooking, but not really. Okay, so in this scenario, okay, first of all, it's about, what, 4.30 right now. Sun's going down. My, my, I have the, sorry, I'm looking in the back here, but I have my, um, my, uh, uh, my phone up and all that stuff and is reading my app, my Tesla app is reading that the sun is producing anywhere between three and 3.4. Um, the solar panel is producing three or 3.4 kilowatt right now. Okay. And, uh, my, I also have my car plugged in right now. However, I made an adjustment. Okay. Normally I would have my car charging at 40 amps. Okay. But right now it's sun's going down. So it's not producing a lot. So, uh, for this demonstration, I made it a point to do this video later in the day to show you guys that even though later in the day, when you do all this cooking and stuff that you can still technically charge your car and use all the house uh, appliances, and all the stuff and still be fine. Okay. So right now, uh, my car is charging. The solar is producing 2.9. I wouldn't, uh, by the way, I will try and embed this uh, video, um, um, the, the app into this video so you can follow along with me, okay? But as of right now, um, the solar right now is reading at three, okay? Or 2.9, I'm sorry, 2.9. And the uh, uh, house consumption varies by 5.7, 5.8, okay? Now, the... Um, the what is it the the battery is discharging at 2.8 kilowatt to meet the solar and the battery is discharging at the same time to meet the 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 home consumption right now okay but when I start cooking with this guy right here okay uh, it will increase it can increase up of course because use a lot of energy this guy uses a lot of energy too okay but it's an electricity guess what it's like so I'm not using any gas or anything like that so this is electricity okay so the whole point of this video is to show like i said to show you guys that it's possible um, but you have to make some changes in your life right my wife and i we you know we switch uh, a lot of our stuff over to electricity like you know buying this air fry we you know buying this air fry and testing it out and uh, using this um and, and you know playing around with different appliances and, and instead of using gas and stuff and all we're using different appliances to uh, to cook our food at now. So this is one example. There will be more example I'm gonna show you guys, but this is one example. By the way, this guy this is a great gadget. Watch. You, you get you guys are gonna see this and it's like you it's gonna blow your mind. Okay? But this is remember there's only one thing I'm cooking with. There's many other things you can do with, okay? But like I said, the point of this video is to show you, you can do it and you can uh, but I mean, you can do it, but you just got to make some changes in your life, okay? It's not that much hard, you know, that much of a change. And, you know, my wife and I would make these changes to do, um, try to live this uh, sustainability, uh, um, the sustainable life as much as we can, okay? I mean, of course, it's never ever going to be 100%, but, you know, uh, we, we're trying to do our part. So this is how we're using our electricity, okay? So right now... Um, the kilowatt on the solar is 2.7. Um, uh, I'm sorry, the house, let's start with the house. House consumption is 2.7, okay? Now I'm gonna turn this on, okay? I'm gonna turn it on, okay? And the house consumption is gonna kick up quite a bit, okay? Well, this is heating up. Okay, so here's pota some potato wedges, okay? I'm gonna cook potatoes today. We're gonna do potatoes, okay, in a healthy way. So I took some potato wedges, I cook them, I mean I cut them in big wedges, thin wedges, different wedges to give you, to show you how this air fryer works, okay? So um, here we go, okay? And it's very healthy too. So you get some olive, cut them in wedges, get some olive oil, put in about say maybe a teaspoon of oil, right? Teaspoon of oil, that's all you really need. Toss it with your hand. My hand was clean. My hand are clean. Okay, I just wa I washed them before uh, I did this video here. So just mix it up. Okay. The purpose of mixing just a little olive oil here is so it doesn't stick. Okay, and it helps it fry. Now you can use other oil, but like I said, my wife and I we're trying to be a little healthy here, 
and um, using this air fryer and using electricity and so on. Okay. Okay. So we got the olive oil. Now you can sprinkle a little bit of, of uh, salt on here right now, but I like to do it afterward and season it. Put some seasoned salt on there. Okay. So right now with my with my car charging at 15 amps, air fryer going on. My whole house is running. My house is pulling. It's pulling 6.5 right now kilowatt. Okay. The house is um, the house is pulling in. Uh, the, I'm sorry. The solar is discharge. Um, is producing 3.2. By the way, that ding ding means that it's preheated. It's ready to go. Okay. So let me put this in. So you put pause right there. Just throw it in like so. Shake it up a little bit. Put it in. Boom. I'm gonna set the time here. I like to watch my uh, potato when I'm doing this so that, you know, I mean, they said it's like anywhere 15, 20 minutes, right? But I just like to watch it because I like it a little extra crispy. So we're gonna turn it on. Now, I like every five minutes, you can set the timer. Every five minutes you go in there and you toss it a little bit, okay? Toss it a little bit and, um, and get the thing, um, you know, flip it and toss it and stuff. And so that both side and all the side will be crunchy and come out really nice, okay? So right now, my air fryer, okay, my, my air fryer charging the car, run the whole entire house is 7.3 kilowatt pulling, okay? My solar is producing 3.2. The, um, the battery is kicking out 4.2, okay? Now, I got a little, a little bit of the grid pu uh, was pushed in and I was told it's like 0.1 kilowatt, right? And I was told that the, how the program works, okay, um, the Tesla, to, Tesla technician told me how the program works is that um, the gateway is what they call the control, the controller, the gateway, control all this stuff, is that sometimes it will draw a little bit from the, um, from the grid, if it's, the grid's available. If the grid's not available, they won't do it, but it, if the grid's available, sometimes it will pull in just a little bit just to stabilize the, the draw, okay? But it doesn't, it's not necessarily the time because I try this where I pull the uh, the power i mean i i, I uh, pull the switch on the power on the main power uh, panel and run just solar and battery and didn't need to pull anything okay so right now um on the screen it, it's reading that it it's not um, um it's not pulling anything from the grids so it's pure solar 3.2 from the panel and 4. Uh, 4.1 from the um from the battery, giving a total of 7.3 kilowatt pull in the house. Everything's stable, nothing's glitchy, everything's running fine, okay? Um, before, I, before I started this, my battery is full, so now it's pulling for my battery, okay? So let me flip on over here. Use my phone, flip on over, and get out of this. Right now, my battery's still reading 100%, okay? Still pulling 100%, so, you know, I was topped off. So let me switch back to the flow. back to the flow here okay so right now um, everything's fooling everything's from solar and everything's from uh, from the battery okay so we'll just wait right now got about you know let's go in there okay sorry I forgot to hit the, the go it was it was working but it was forgot to now it's going to start counting down okay so I'll come back in a little bit and um, give you a little um, preview of the um, the food okay or the the potato this nice grill right here and it's, it's pretty clean because we don't use it as much as we used to right so that's a great thing so um, so we just you know just sits there looks pretty it's fine. Um, oh, some people ask me like, why did you switch out of this um, uh, gas and get into electric for this one? The reason why is I I had a smaller one in here, and before we got the solar and all this stuff, right? Before we got the solar and all this stuff, we went ahead and 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 uh, I bought uh, this one for my wife. Got a big, you know, big, you know, it's much bigger than the one we had before, and I. I did a DIY project, made this bigger, so I bought this, and this was before the solar. Now, in hindsight, if we didn't change out and um, 
if it's occurring right now, I would probably get electric, maybe con the conduction, the conduction one. So that's the reason why we have still have the gas and it's fine. I mean, we use it for other things, you know, uh, boil water real quick or whatever it may be, okay? But, uh, you know, it's, uh, it still has its usage. Don't get me wrong, I mean, we're still gonna use gas. Like in the winter, we're still gonna use heated, uh, heat the house with gas and stuff like that. But in, in California, it doesn't get too cold. But, okay, but we're still gonna use this. So, um, looks pretty though. <laughs> All right, anyway. I'll be back in a bit, okay, and I'll show you how it turns out, okay? Hey guys, I'm back. Um, so, the air fryer's been going on for about uh, 15 minutes or about five minutes left. I just checked it. It looks pretty good. I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna pause it for a second. I'm gonna show you, okay? Man, it smells awesome. Now, I wish you guys were here. It smells delicious, dude. Okay, so usually I take out about every five minutes and you know, I usually just stir it around here, but look at this. Uh, I don't know if you can see it right there. Beautiful. But I'll show you a little up close when it's done, okay? So I'm just gonna move it around a little bit. Just toss it a little bit. You know, you can take it out and just toss it like that. But I just take a little fork, move it around a little bit, okay? Move around a little bit and turn it back on, okay? While that is running, okay, I'm gonna jump out of the screen a little bit because I'm gonna, um, you're gonna hear my voice, so I'm gonna still keep on talking. But I'm gonna show you on the screen of, um, of uh, you know, the, on the app of uh, my car charging and all that stuff, okay? So you'll hear my voice here, okay? I apologize for that. So anyway, so here we go. So here is my, um, my app right on the flow, okay? The solar, uh, the house is, is currently using 6.5 kilowatts, okay? And um, the solar is uh, producing two, uh, two kilowatts and the house is giving off 4.5 kilowatts, okay? So let's go to the next screen. My battery current, um, uh, my, my current battery charge level, okay, is at 93% right now and it is, um 449 i have no idea why my app is saying 9441 so ignore that okay guys i promise you ignore that i promise you right here it's um not a little time trick okay right there okay for um 449 i have no idea why the app is reading 9.45, so this is not a trick, okay guys? Now I'm not doing the daytime. And plus even if it's a 9.41, the battery wouldn't, you know, the solar, uh, and, well actually it would still be produced, but anyway, believe me. So anyway, let's go to the next slide, okay? Let's go to the next slide. This is my car right now. See that, it's being plugged in and charged, okay? Now let's go to charging right there. See that, it's 15 amps, right here, 15 amps, okay? So it's producing a 15, um, uh, I mean, I'm sorry, charging at 15 amps at 240 volts, okay? Which is the high, vol uh, super, um, the, the high voltage charging I have at home. Okay, now it's charging 11 miles per hour. Now you're probably saying it's gonna take seven hours and 15 minutes to charge the rest of the way, okay? You're thinking like, oh my God, man, what, that's not, you know that's that's crazy right but you got you got to think about it it's during i i set it up this way because i meant it um i try to do this scenario during the evening time so that you guys can see that it is possible to charge your car and and, and cook and all that stuff okay so um so so i mean it's it yeah it looks really bad 11 miles per an hour is gonna take forever but this is a this is the scenario Okay, so it's not the idealistic scenario, okay? So like noontime, 11 o'clock noontime, probably be best to charge it, okay? We got about two minutes left on the um, air fryer and I'm gonna show you uh, what it looks like, okay? So um, it's pretty simple. I mean, it was like, what, 20 minutes on the air fryer, you get some fresh fries, healthy, uh, you know? Also, I'm growing, um, these are store-bought uh, potatoes but I'm also growing uh, potatoes currently right now. I have videos for that too. Um, and um, like I said, um, my wife and I are just trying to live the, as much as uh, the sustainable life as we can, okay? So 
uh, in future visit I'll show you about uh, you know the potatoes and other garden we're planting other things that we plan on cooking to eat and all that stuff too so okay so 34 seconds guys let's see how it turns out you know when I when I got this thing I like there was a I mean I bought it and uh, there was little doubts in my mind about it but after a few usage and I mean we had trial and error there's a couple times I burnt the fries and a couple times was you know didn't come out the best but you play around with it and it's great now remember it's not just just not just you know fries that we're cooking, we're cooking other things too but this is just this video I'm showing you this okay there we go it's done okay so let's take it out wow Look at this, nice and golden. Beautiful. Look at this, guys. Look at this. Look at this. Mmm. Dang. Any of you guys out there, techie, please develop smell smell of vision, okay? Because whoo, smells so good. Gotta have Lowry seasoned salt. This is what we use. Okay, so put it on here. Put a little bit. I toss it a little bit. Okay. A little bit more. Toss it again. Okay. I forgot something. Something about it. You don't dip ketchup. I mean, dip a fries in the ketchup, pretty un-American of you, okay? So gotta have the ketchup. I don't care what else you dip your, your fries in, but for me, gotta do ketchup, man. Un-American if you don't, okay? Look at this. Look at this. Look at these potato wedges. Look at this. Nice and crisp. Look at that. Oh, hot, hot, sorry. Dang, it's good. Mm -mm. Look at that, guys. Mm. Mm -mm. Look at that. Mmm, crazy good. Crazy good, crazy good. Okay? So, there you have it. Air fryer, Tesla solar, Tesla battery, right? Charging my car, almost 5 o'clock. Insane, right? I mean, this is free energy. I mean, technically it's not free. I'm still paying for it, but you can get my drip. We're maximizing what we use. We don't have to use gas anymore. It's all electricity coming from the sun. Okay? Once again, guys, I mean, this is cooking. This is a cooking with Tesla uh, solar and battery. Okay? Once again, an Elon we trust. Peace out. Have a wonderful day, guys. Take care. Mm -hmm.